Hey guys, I'm Greg with the Fix My Bleak channel. Thanks so much for joining me today. So on this video, I'm gonna be doing an unboxing of the Cooler Master. This is a liquid cooled RGB pump, and this has a third generation dual pump technology. There's a link in the description where you can find this. I'm gonna be covering the specs, all the cool functions that it does, why I chose this particular Cooler Master over any of the other pumps that are available out there on the market. So be sure and like and subscribe to my channel. Let's get into the video, you guys. Let's check this out. All right, you guys, just a little bit of a closer look at the box here. So this is the Master Liquid ML240L RGB White Edition with third generation dual chamber pump technology. And this does have the RGB 16.7 million colors built into it. And right up here, it does say certified compatible with. It's got the Aura, the AS, Rock, the uh, Gigabyte, and the MSI. All right, you guys, turn the box up on its end here. It does give you increased surface area, greater surface area improved, heat dissipation, and enhanced cooling performance. Wired RGB controller allows for colored, customized, and lighting effects. Third gen dual chamber pump, newly designed dual chamber pump for improved overall cooling efficiency and performance. Always good to have. Let's turn it over yet again. It does have the dual uh, 120 millimeter fans on it. Bottom of the box. Take a look at the back of the box, you guys. Stuff the language is there. All right, you guys, looking at the specifications here, it does talk about the socket that this will work with, your Intel sockets and your AMD sockets. So AMD, uh, AMD4, AMD, AM3, AM3+, AM2+, AM2, FM, 2 plus FM2, FM1, and then your Intel sockets. Not going to read them all off, but they are right there. Water block dimensions, radiator dimensions, your fan speed, airflow, noise connector is a four pin connector rated voltage standard right there profiles rgb two year warranty all right you guys so time to actually unbox this cooler master and take a look at it and see what's included Packing materials. Couple of big fans there. Some warranty information. There's our booklet right here. Our white edition master liquid RGB white edition booklet here. Gives you the inst installation instructions. Take a look at that in a minute. A couple of great looking fans. Let's get it all unpacked. Uh, 
Oh yeah, there we go. Here's our main uh, radiator and our processor cooler right here. We've got a hardware kit right here. That is everything in the box, you guys. Go ahead and get rid of the box. All right, you guys, so for starters, this is the 240 millimeter radiator that I ordered. And I went a little bit bigger because I'm gonna have this baby cool in the Ryzen 9 processor I ordered. And this thing runs a little bit hot. It's Ryzen 9 3950X, so it's the uh, 16 core 32 thread processor. So it's gonna have its work cut out for it, so I did not want to undersize my cooling system. So, and this is a solid radiator. So take a good look at that. It feels like it's really well built. Cooler Master sealed radiator system here. Got all sorts of mounting uh, holes pre-drilled in it and everywhere. everywhere. Now one thing I do want to note you guys, you'll notice there's a thin uh, skin of plastic on here. You want to be sure and remove this plastic before you uh, mount this on the processor with your thermal paste. So be sure and get this off of here before you put your thermal paste on there. So just one thing to note. All right, you guys, so just a quick look at uh, some of the plugs that come with these items here. So for the radiator and the CPU cooler itself, this comes with an RGB plug right there and it comes with your fan plug right there that'll go down to the board for power and then this is your rgb plug so here's your two 120 millimeter fans hopefully they're as smooth as they look and as quiet as they look but it comes with a couple of plugs as well this plug goes down to your board for power right there this plug is an RGB plug. They do send uh, some cables for RGB. This looks like an adapter or an extension cable, I should say. It's got RGB male and female. Looks like a splitter for the fans. Your other 120 millimeter fan, same thing. Two plugs, one for RGB and the other plug for power. We've got mounting hardware, AMD mounting hardware, and then we've got your, this looks like your Intel mounting hardware over here, more processor mounting hardware. Here's your mounts, or your thumb screws I should say. We've got another, this is an older style power plug right here. This is an RGB remote that they send with you. And they also send these cables as well. These are power. Go down to the board. And then don't forget the ever important thermal paste that is included. And looking at the instructions, you guys, so I hate to say it, but the AMD installation looks so much simpler than the Intel processor installation. Just saying. And so one thing worth noting as well, you probably don't need this. This is a little wired remote for your RGB, but if you're using the right board, you may not need this. I'm using the uh, MSI. MPG X570 Gaming Plus motherboard right there and there's a link to it right here if you want to check that unboxing out and so there may not be a need for that little wired remote. 
So hopefully we'll see how that turns out. Hey you guys, thanks so much for joining me today. Be sure and leave a comment. Let me know what kind of cooling systems you're running in your own systems at home. I'd love to hear from you. Be sure and like and subscribe to my channel. Check out these other videos and I'll catch you guys later.